Greetings, people of the internet. I'm Adam, or Vox Gaming, and today is Stargate Maps 8. It's not technically a map from Stargate, neither are most of them, but they're maps that go well with the Stargate mod. Now, this map is called Area 51. It's massive, it's amazing. It has a load of Stargates. It also has really massive doors and a lot of underground shit to explore, so. Thank god we do have stargates, but there's also teleports here, if, you know, stargate travel isn't cool enough for you. So where should we start? Pool hangar, we'll start there, because I know where this is. Now, quite literally, this map is, like, my favourite. You could do so much if you're into that kind of stuff, right, role-playing stuff. You know, it's so good for this. Literally, this is underground, this is one section. I'm just gonna cut through. So, one part I love, which hopefully this is working. Up here, you got sort of a rocket launcher bay. Well, not rocket launcher is in the weapon, rocket launcher is in a rocket could be launched. As in, you could make a rocket, stick it here, and blast off. I would kill to see that video if it exists. Please link it in the comments. There are also rings everywhere. I'll say I seem to be a bit bugged, but I don't know if that's a mod I might have installed. At least I'm a little more larvary. I like it. Uh, where else can we go? What have we got? Large hangar, build area 2. Large hangar. That looks awesome. In red at least. Badass. Oh yes, now that is a lot of stuff. Okay, so I think it's telling us to go in here, quite possibly. Giant, giant area. I believe this is a elevator. So I press the button, will I go down? Yes, I will. Now look at this huge amount of space. I'm pretty sure you could fit a Daedalus in here. You know what, I might just have to try that quickly. We'll go in a mid-air here, and we're going to spawn a Daedalus. Ooh, caps out of date. As per usual, because I haven't updated it. Now, ships. Let's spawn a Daedalus. Please tell me there's enough room. Oh my god, there is actually enough room for a Daedalus. I think I might have put it a bit too high, though. No, 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 no. Oh, it is just that little bit too high. Oh, we've got to respawn it. Come on. Uh, okay, so it's spawning in its own. Okay. Yeah, that works. Let's get in. Oh my god, yes. We've got enough room to fly Daedalus around in here. I actually don't know the controls for the Daedalus, but... Oh, okay. That just happened. I no fancy editing that. I just glitched it somehow through the wall. It's not here, so I don't know what happened, so uh, bear with me on this. Uh, lovely big tower, nice and red. Has an elevator, but I'm just going to use the quick method of flying. Nice view of the whole area. I mean, over there, no idea what that is. That's like a few floors of building area, that's the rocket launching place. That is, well, it's all part of an airfield, so... You know, stuff can happen. There is also a, uh, sometimes, I don't know where it spawns, but there is a UFO that will fly around. It's on sort of an underground part of the map. Down there, see there it is. It hasn't, you got to do something on the map for it to actually work. And here is a nice actual room. Uh, there's no Stargate that takes you here, so you've got to walk here. Basically, uh, takes away all your guns and you can get a load of guns up here. I'm just going to fly up and grab some. It's not even giving me any. Ah, Stargate guns, please. Use my favourite. Ooh. Ah, it's because it doesn't like it because I'm not supposed to have guns in here. That is... That is strange. That is weird. I shouldn't play around with that. Uh, let's try another gun. There we go. But yeah, you can spawn in a load of combines and stuff. 
and they'll start coming around. I'll also be telling these guys and striders. I hate striders. They are just annoying. But yeah, this whole room is amazing. And then you come out and boom, it gives you all your tool guns back because it won't let you go in there with your tool guns and stuff. Now here we have a race course because apparently at Area 51 you race. It makes sense. Massive, massive swimming pool. Mucky water though. I wish it was sort of clearer water, but you know, I'm not going to be picky. Is that a lift over there? I'm sort of hoping it is. Yes, it is. Oh wow. Um, I hope that opens. Ah oh, yes. Oh. Ah, so now we know what that part is. Also shows you where you are on the facility, which is quite nifty. It's just yeah, it's, this map is brilliant. Uh, what else haven't we done? Build area two chamber. Uh, nope. I'm still disappointed the USO UFO hasn't come yet. Seems a bit darker. Oh, ah, yes. This is where we spawned the Daedalus, which is apparently destroyed. I didn't actually get into doing this. We, I just spawned the Daedalus. Now, in here, this tube is sort of low gravity tube. I don't know if you can. Really. I was pretty set on this map not being able to kill me, and. Oh, I. I forgot I set them loose. Okay, uh, and we've just lost our tool gun and everything. I suppose that's okay. Now over here, I like to call this sort of the car park area. Oh, it suddenly slowed down. But yeah, the car park area. You can drive up, you can park, you can do a load of stuff here. If you've got any of the car mods installed, which I, at this particular moment, don't, you know, it's it's a fun drive around. I've had fun flying a TARDIS around here. It's quite enjoyable. I think this is the red room. Nothing actually happens here. It just flashes red and it looks freaky. And I think this room is just completely dark. But yeah, nothing in there. It's all empty and it's rather creepy. So, uh, considering I'm recording this at about 2 o'clock in the morning, it's even better. What's in here? Oh wow! Oh, this is the uh, the ship control. Also, uh, there is a button over here that closes it back up. Also, this place is a swimming pool as well. If I didn't mention, which is pretty damn nifty. Is there still no sign of the UFO? Do you think you have to be on the map for a certain amount of time? Also. Clicking on this will make the uh, water rise, which is also quite nice. I think you can see it there. And of course, it's Gmod, so it's not going to overflow. But yeah, this map is absolutely fantastic. I feel like flying something around. Actually, since we've got these landing strips and, well, I suppose takeoff strips as well, we could do this. Get one of the F three O twos. Is it did it spawn? Now it did. I don't know where that one spawned. Okay, I haven't used one of these in a while. Oh, okay. It, what? Oh, mistakes were made. I remember you've got to get rid of the takeoff gear somehow. Is it? Oh, the, the F. G, X. No. Okay, we'll go the other way. I will click buttons until I figure out which one it is. If not, I could just actually just read the controls and save us a lot of time. Let's, let's just find the controls. Ships. Yeah. Um, have instructions. Oh, this is gonna go bad. Okay, you know what? Let's just gonna do this. L M N. Oh, what? What have I done? 
that was new. Um. Okay. Um. I don't know what I just did, but I sort of enjoyed it. I swear it was all along the lines of Z and X, but Z takes things away, so. Okay, that's the. Oh, really? Okay, you know what? Easier ship time. I'm just gonna fail at this. Because I'm, I'm useless. So we're just gonna use the death shuttle. Because it doesn't actually need to take off of anything, but it still looks awesome. Now we shoot things. Because we're on alien attacking area 51. So I don't imagine it going well. Yeah, anyway, as said, I'll put the map's full name in the description. It's downloadable off the Steam Workshop if you own Gary's Mod. Which, if you don't own Gary's Mod, you should probably get it. It's only like five quid. And it's super fun. I suppose you can call it a game, but it's whatever you want it to be, really. But yeah, I'm Adam, and uh, I'll see you next time.